I don't like my free souvenir from uh, the Blue Ridge Mountains. We just came back from a trip. I'm actually working on the vlog, so make sure you subscribe so you can check that out. But anyways, I took my gigging guitar and I noticed that the strings were very old, so I replaced them. I clearly did it the wrong way. I didn't know there was a wrong way to string your guitars. I'm gonna show you guys what I did wrong and how you should correctly restring your guitars, your nylon string guitars. So when I put my strings yesterday, I noticed that the string had gone all the way to the edge when you're rolling the string, when you're turning the knob, where the string starts to touch the outer part of the guitar. And there's a little groove there. So what happened is that the string got caught on that groove. I noticed yesterday that it was hard to rotate and when I got to my gig and I tried to do it even harder, that's when this part here broke off. Fortunately, I have a very good luthier who's actually featured on another video. He's the star of that video, make sure you watch that one. And he advised me to glue it temporarily while I get a new part here to replace the tuners. And that's what I did, that's how I, I can use it now. I can tune it now. So to make it short, when you are restringing your guitar, when it's being wound, make sure you have enough room for the string not to touch either side of the guitar. And you can quickly and easily rotate here without any unnecessary tension. I can't believe that it took me thousands of times of restringing my guitar just to find that out. Another good idea is to properly lubricate the machinery with oil or uh, W40 or whatever you want to use. Remove some of that tension in the tuners make it way easier and that way you can also get rid of all the squeaky noises when you're tuning your guitar. So this was a very short video and hopefully it's helpful to you. Thanks for subscribing and liking and commenting. Let me know what other video ideas you want to see on this channel and thank you. I'll see you in the next one.